Training a foundational model can still be incredibly challenging. First, customers need to acquire large amounts of data, create and maintain a large cluster of accelerators, write code to distribute model training across a cluster, frequently inspect and optimize the model, and manually remediate any hardware issues. And all of these steps require deep ML expertise. Let me dive into some of these challenges to understand why it is so complex. Now, because of the massive size of these foundational models and the data set used for training, developers need to split their data into chunks and load them into the individual chips in a training cluster, a distributed cluster with hundreds or even thousands of accelerators. This is a lot of work because in order to make efficient use of these compute and network resources, the distribution needs to be tailored to the characteristics of the data, your model architecture, as well as the underlying hardware configurations. That means you have to write a lot of code and optimize it frequently. In addition, customers need to frequently pause and inspect the model performance, optimize the code if something is not working right. To do this, they had to manually take checkpoints of the model state so that the training is able to start without any loss in progress. Finally, when any of these thousands of accelerators in the cluster fail, the entire training process is halted. To resolve this issue, customers had to identify, isolate, repair, and recover the faulty instance or change the configuration of the entire cluster, further delaying the progress. We wanted to make it easier for our customers to train these LLMs without interruption or delays. That's why today I am thrilled to announce the general availability of SageMaker HyperPod. <laughs> this one is a big deal because it's a new distributed training capability that can reduce model training time by up to 40%. HyperPod is pre-configured with SageMaker's distributed training libraries. This enables your data and models to efficiently distribute across thousands of chips in the cluster and process them in parallel. The HyperPod helps customers iteratively pause, inspect, and optimize these models because it automatically takes checkpoints frequently. And if a hardware failure occurs, it detects the failure, it replaces the faulty instance, and resumes the training from the last eight checkpoint. With this new capability, customers will see dramatic improvements by training models for weeks, if not months, without any disruption. But this is just one of the many innovations we announced for SageMaker this week. Today, we are announcing a slew of new SageMaker features across inference, training, and MLOps. I had to extend by an hour if I had to cover all of it, but I'll just do a quick hit and say, SageMaker inference reduces model deployment by 50% on average and achieves better latency by 20%. We also introduced new capabilities in SageMaker Studio, like a new user experience. And all of these updates help customers build, train, and deploy these new large language models even easier.